podcasters, timer, NFTs. All you have to do is remember one date. 02-22-2022 on the first day I uploaded an NFT. I started on Rarible and then I went to OpenSea. Now, I'm going to explain if you're watching for the first time. I'm in my Luna Trap Line 1 and I'm, I was thinking of doing the same kind of lounge for my NFT. So, we're going to leave this. So, this is for you podcasters. This is for possibly anybody that's coming for informa information here. Actually, number one, I'm going to say is I upload every single one of these one by one if you're watching this right now I upload these one by one onto Twitch literally uh, took me a year just to get to 758 and I, and I do not auto load it I want to show people I'm doing the work and I want to show people that I have a physical hand in every single one that you buy in the future at this moment in time I only have a couple literally sold and a third one sold to a friend and nobody really knows I'm here but anybody coming in becoming a first timer and buying becoming a timer that's what I've been calling people in my community and some so-called fans and people that are watching uh, people who've been watching me for a while on Twitch and uh, on Instagram and, and TikTok and, and YouTube and everything on my, my channel. Make it clear that this is something, this is just one collection. Next collection is the timer. Uh, this one I'm at 169 out of 1,000. I'm never doing 10,000 of them per collection. I'm doing only one to 1,000. And every single one is uploaded one at a time and every single one has got the metadata proper on it. I, since I don't automate it, there's no, there's the, the details, but there's no uh, um, uh, DNA on a token kind of thing and everything but I have that all in the metadata everybody if anybody ever wants the DNA I could just email it to them or do you really need it so if you're a podcaster and if you're seeing this for the first time this is done live on twitch and on each one of these it says uh, made live on twitch and and kick VOD is on kick So this is Kick, and since Kick is, doesn't cry about the um, about the music in the background yet, so you could watch the VOD, you could watch the um, all the uh, VODs of all the ones. That, did it take the crypto out? Oh no, there's one there, one there. Okay, yeah. Okay, I was scared a little bit there because, well, anyways, the, that's the VOD, right? And I do about two hours or so, an hour here, two or three hours. I do, I do the uh, crypto VOD on there, so you can actually watch me do it in real time, and I'll be here. And I upload them onto Twitch, uh, roughly around eight o'clock Mountain Standard Time at night. Uh, your best bet is to come at about 8 30 9 o'clock mountain standard time and they'll probably catch me in the middle of doing them live next one I do is Peppy and I thought long and hard about Peppy because it's Matt Fury's frog kind of thing and everybody in their cat is doing these right now but I always said and I'll make it clear right now to you guys that if this ever takes off the high-end uh, gold ones all the gold ones will be anything made off those will be handed straight over to Matt what should be these uh, gold ones here uh, unfortunately my camera's behind it so okay so I have very few 
and there'll always be very few and uh, these even though I have them for Matic and everything like some of the future ones that are gold I'll hand them straight over to Matt Fury or transfer them over or I'll just give them money or something like that because it's the right thing to do and uh, if you're a podcaster here, here's a simple fact here's gold bars instead of buying the real thing you can buy the gold bar here now you're probably asking yourself what's the time thing and I'm gonna explain that to you I'm the only person in the world and NFTs to put badges uh, this copper ones here these are dollar a day these are dollar an hour silver ones go up a dollar a minute and the gold ones here those go up a dollar a second forever now what's gonna happen is if you're a podcaster and all you guys out there in the world uh, uh, they're all timed by one day the twos of history and I chose the twos of history February 22 2022 which is 02 22 so every single person in the world will remember that date and you buy and sell from that date now if people have a problem with that on my channel I'm gonna have it so I'll, I'll announce it every day well the price of all these will be uh, officially roll I rise raise the price of my art and that's the price of each one of those days and then you buy and sell if, if people can't grasp this because I get a lot of pushback on that but uh, in, in other words you can't lose in the future you could you literally would not have to worry about watching the market uh, with my stuff or anything because you you know what it is because it all goes by the counter right so if you watch if you're a podcast you watch this every single one has this badge the seal in the corner called time price crypto price rises one dollar a minute now i get a lot of pushback and a lot of people in the world saying oh you can't do that oh that uh, nobody will nobody will buy it nobody will believe it and maybe they're right because nobody is nobody is buying it literally or I'm not out there in the world but if you're a podcaster if you're somebody from open sea just seeing what this is all about and everything it's it's based it's based on like a all oh, I'm treaty status I'm a treaty status native from Canada it's based on a tally stick kind of thing uh, where stuff is priced over time where say you owe somebody 10 fish and you have a stick and then you notch it and say each notch uh, you owe somebody a fish and somebody comes in and says okay you owe me a fish you give them a fish and then they notch it so it's time it's every couple of days you owe them a fish or every four days you owe them, a, owe them a fish kind of thing and there's other ways to tally but that is kind of my um, take on it in a sense that we have time now and we could literally time to time but nobody in the world does that there's nothing in the world that's timed it unless you say uh, uh, bonds mature in 30 years and so technically they're priced by time in a way but it's just a promise to pay at a certain amount of time kind of thing for a bond but nobody thinks in terms you think in terms of uh, uh, 30 years of cash this bond and I make my money but this at any given time all you do is like uh, you own one of these how much is it it's uh eleven thousand one hundred eighty one dollars that's for anyone 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 with a badge on it any single one how much is this one this one is four hundred sixty five dollars because it is timed by the day and the minutes uh, silver one if you go down the list gold one here's the here's the controversy this is going to be this is basically going to be conversation piece because this is the price in seconds 40 million 252 thousand 195 seconds equals the dollars in that so you could buy that literally for a dollar i think i have those this one's actually a dollar you can actually put that for 40 million right off the bat if all the collections sell out in the end I'm gonna have 10 collections of one to a thousand each so which will be 10,000 1,000 1,000 to 10 you know what I mean 
Did I lose you? Now, it's the same thing with these. And you don't really have to worry about traits or anything, even though traits there's gonna be rarities and stuff like that, because some backgrounds uh some backgrounds are rarer than others. Uh, you can do it the traditional way or you know exactly what what you, each one of these are. This is uh $365. It's a concept that has never been done before in the history of basically anything, I don't think. And I did a lot of research and then... And here, here's the thing. So this is my art channel. Now all the war paint, there's 400 different war paints and all those NFTs uh, have about 400 different war paints and all those pictures and everything. And what I did is I created paintings, these paintings here, and they're all priced by time. And, and they're all done a unique way, which you're gonna see here. Hey, my name is Joseph Trust Kong, Few Modern Art. One dollar per second. Forever. One dollar per second. They're a dollar a minute. Four. Dollar a second is crazy. Well, that's possible. Still possible. Canvas art. Joseph Charles Joseph, Joseph, Cobb. View modern art. Now... Now here, here's the simple fact, is the art world, some art people in the art world, if you're watching this as a podcaster, some people in the art world know I exist, and what I'm going to do is all these are timed from the day they were uploaded, so the price of this one is by the minutes, which is ads. I gotta have to switch all mine to this. This one's better. These guys, just too much ads. Uh, this is better. So that painting is two million dollars, fourteen thousand five hundred sixty bucks, basically. And take it or leave it. So that's what I want. And every single one of these. Except for these ones, these are canvas gold bars on the ounce price, so they were done. And now, you're probably sick of yourself. Uh, sorry, buddy, I can't play Fortnite right now. I'm making videos. It's more important. Do I shut this down for now and go play video games? Uh, so, so the, the simple fact is, here, here's my track record for time pressing, right? Now, in the art world, it hasn't caught on because nobody in our art world really knows I exist and and the story. So, and you could see what the each piece of art is worth because this is three years, which is uh, each year is a half, so it's a 1.5 million. So as you go back in time, four years, each one of these are two million some dollars, the way I see it. And the people that own these can claim that. I don't know, maybe is this one going to work? The critics can own this for free, so... Might work. Yeah, here it is. 2276317 So... the ones are straight, they're probably worth something more. So... That's... Um, let's put this one up. So that's where the... My... Dollar... A minute, dollar, second, dollar, an hour concept came from it's from my own my own thing right and if that's not crazy enough 400 different war paints on 4,000 to 5,000 videos I played in the war paint literally in video games for many years actually and so that's where the whole war paint 
comes into play kind of thing because if you don't understand what the, and how did I do so many war paints that's pretty simple I hey. played I played video games in war paint and it never really got anywhere how are you guys doing it is 2018 I hope every single one of you had a good very good uh, New Year's so I thought so you got somebody here that put war paint and and when I put this war paint on and uh fascinated if you're a podcaster this is a story this is a story to be told in the NFT world I don't think there is going to be a story like this far from it so if you're a first time buyer if you're somebody that's just stumbled onto my NFTs or anything this is the backstory now yes 4,000 to 5,000 videos of Planet said I chose the one game nobody knows about. If you were watching this right now, I'd probably know, don't even know what Planet Side is. Uh, in a nutshell, Planet Side is a, a game that 3,000 people could play in one area, fighting each other with three different factions with up to 1,500 each side. Roughly at this moment in time, 10 years after the game started, there's about 400 people playing in, in a battle in the same area. I don't do the war paint no more because I just got burnt out on it. And then after I did the paintings, I only did 200 paintings and then I kind of quit. So, the industry for So, second. So, guess what? No, so, none of these no, people, this is the fight. So none of these this people, is the fight. This is what I'm talking about. No, not even Crazy close. fight. So, what the hell? So these are the up and coming ones that uh, I'm doing one by one and it's going to be uh, uh, when this this project's done. When this project's done, then it's done. And then here's all the metadata. So um, I upload one and put the metadata on. This is the metadata on this one. And I literally do them one by one if you watch me on Twitch. And here's all the peppy ones coming up. Every single one's gonna be hand loaded onto OpenSea only to 1,000. What the thousandth one gonna be a special one, uh, one of one of, uh, owned by me kind of thing? Maybe I don't know. Maybe I'll give it away. I don't know. Pro probably owned by me. And the rest of these two. all one by ones. Probably I calculate it's probably gonna take me three years. Probably. To the end of the bull run or to the middle of the bull run that's why i'm doing it slowly because i'm trying to hit the bull run out of i'm trying to time it where the bull runs technically start now and hopefully it hits the bull run in the middle of 2025 sometime and i should be done this whole collection plus i have three to four collections i think i'm at seven Maybe three collections, future collections. Uh, one I have coming up that hasn't even been uploaded yet. That I have the artwork almost done for it and everything. And and my gold bars. I'm really proud of my gold bars. I re you know why buy real gold when you can have this gold and this is cooler. Uh, I have to finish this out to a thousand yet, but I'm got a ways to go to this, so I'm not in no hurry. And if you buy my project and uh, people own it, you can actually get, there's a shelf right there. And the shelf has little LED houses all lit up and everything, and it's a little community. And you could literally rent a room. Uh, you could buy the land, buy the rent a room, get the property. Uh, uh, this uh, this is for sale, the whole shelf's for sale. Uh, this is mine, but I put it for sale by accident and I just left it up. And uh, here's the uh, this is the, here's the building owner. You can own the building and people rent in your building kind of thing. So you're kind of like the landlord and there's people renting. Well, you don't you don't collect nothing off it. 
owner of the arrowhead here kind of thing so if you buy the projects then you have a place to stay you you could literally rent uh, this room here you rented the room and then all your friends buying my project you could uh, you can rent the next room over literally and you live in this building on this piece of land on the edge on the end here that's the concept uh, uh, kind of an, uh, a real place that you could rent as an MT and technically you live on the shelf behind me I think that's kind of it's kind of crazy maybe but I think it's cool what well, what you're getting podcasters if we came this far well, how many minutes 20 minutes we're not gonna make this long less than half an hour maybe around half an hour I'm almost done well what you got here is a financial warrior for you in the future and anybody watching any podcast or anybody watching uh, anybody that works for OpenSea I chose you I am not going to anybody else except I'm going to do some uh, BRC20 but I don't know I'm kind of loyal to OpenSea because OpenSea let me do it for free let me do put these all up for free and I've never had a problem with OpenSea They've never said, oh, you can't do this. I, uh, that's too weird. They never said anything. But if OpenSea happened to come here, maybe I'd direct them to this someday. And I say, here, here is somebody that did the work, did five years of war paint painting. And if you look here and the war paint, uh, where's the war paint? Down below it, uh, behind the camera again. Just. This is how much war paint just in this collection, and and some at the very bottom are rare. That's all there's too. And there's like a couple hundred to I don't know how much there is now. I totally forgot how much. And some I made some rare. Uh, since I hand bomb, these are the first ones I hand bombed. I kind of screwed up here and there. So uh, people coming in going. Oh, I, I click on this and uh, the background, uh, it says there's this many background, but there's actually more or less because uh, I screwed up uh, and I haven't fixed some of it, but it's there. It's there. Uh, but uh, some stuff I just have no control. I have no control. Like, let's look at this one. But uh, I think I did a good job. I think I did a good job. Did I deserve only four owners? Or literally two owners? Two unique buyers? These two are unique buyers. This one I made somebody, I made somebody this, but I made them pay like five bucks. I, Cause I don't believe in transfers. I don't believe in airdrops cause I don't want stuff to, uh, and people say, oh, you got to airdrop, you got to give it away. I, I don't want to be that guy to, to beg people to buy and sell my stuff. If you want one really bad enough, they're going to be, they're cheap. They're about a buck each and they're cheap. And how much is, could this guy who, uh, one random dude bought one of mine and, and he's going to end up with some gold ones. And how much is his right now? He can literally put his for 67 or er, eleven thousand one hundred and eighty one dollars tomorrow goes up another twenty four dollars because it's twenty four it's a dollar an hour so it's twenty four every single day forever and people are actually looking at it on his end uh, that's a good thing because maybe maybe someday so podcasters first timers my timer community I hope I hope this gave you a lot of information because I get a lot of oh you're trying, you're a big scammer oh how you can't do that now you know the backstory and if anybody says to you any you who are a podcaster out there any influencer or anything like that it's pretty simple now you know the backstory and you can say you know what I hope you can back me up on this because I am getting so much I, on Reddit I'm getting I put my stuff to 10 different reddits now where I used to put it in 20 different reddits and half of them banned me because they just think it's a, I'm a scam but anybody that puts war paint on his face maybe that is weird but it makes me unique it makes me 
unique than every single other NFT out there because it's pretty simple. This financial warrior, you could almost call it a Wall Street warrior because you buy this and you even if you forget about it and every single one is sold and there's one out of a thousand of this and it'll never be more than that. It, it's going to be a scarcity in itself where you can go into a board ape or any other one and there's 10,000, 16,000, 20,000 and at least here you know that even if you're holding a silver one here and how much is a silver one and it, yes it's a crazy price it's 670,889 but you know people 69 million sale for his JPEG and, and, the, and then people say well how can you even say that yours is as good as, as his. Well, he took a collage of like 10,000 images or a thousand, I don't know how many images, collage them all together because he spent work on it. Well, guess what? This is not Photoshopped. You saw by the, the videos on my gaming videos and everything, it's not Photoshop. This is actual work to paint that. This probably, if I remember, this one I was trying to do a modern art masterpiece kind of thing. And this one, uh, one I made for Jane Sibri, uh, uh, her painting, uh, a gift to her. She might not even know about it, it's, it's here somewhere, her her painting. It was a gift to her, name's Jane. It's for Jane Sibri, she's a musician, Canadian musician, since I'm Canadian. So. What you're getting is something unique and you never have to worry about the price and even though you buy this for a buck and say the whole and this is for you this is 100% clear for you podcasters out there influencers watching this for the first time even if the whole thing sells out and say two of these sell for this somebody came in you know what uh, I know this six hundred seventy thousand dollars. I bought it. He buys it, and then a year from now, it's another sixty-seven or six hundred seventy thousand. So it's a hundred or six and six is twelve, so twelve. It's about a million three hundred thousand, right? A uh, year after that's another sixty-seven year, and so on, so on, so on. So if you complain about this now, imagine it ten years from now. And these are kind of scarce. Maybe there's twenty of these. I, I don't know how many. I think there's a lot of these silver ones but the floor on the silver ones are going to be a little higher than all obviously than all the other ones uh will these sell for half a million each who knows but it's a half a million each right now wait till the end of next year then they're about a about a middle of next year then they're a million a shot each one of these will be a million bucks. Um, Far-fetched, mountain that can't climb, I, I hear this all the time. Far-fetched, mountain that can't climb, impossible. NFTs are dead. Guys, if you're watching this right now, everybody knows one small, small detail. Bull run is coming. The Bitcoin halving is happening in 2024 and I follow this. Uh, that's why you saw the, the Chuck Ball's trap line because I follow crypto and stuff like that and if I'm working hard on this and some people may be in the bull run or remember me and say you know what where's that guy where's that guy with the crazy war paint I I have like 10 million bucks to spend and and I want to go buy one of his now because he, he was crazy enough to do that and I hope so and I hope by you guys who are um, influencer podcaster talk amongst your people I think it's time if you're watching this to the end I think it's time to start put I, I think it's time for you people who are watching this here you see me in the flesh you see the project you see the art you know the backstory this is a good story for your thing even if I don't have no views or, or people buying the project maybe I earned a right right now for you as an influencer, as you as a podcaster, you as a first time buyer, you as part of the, the timer community now, you buy and sell by what is our concrete date? 02 22 2022. You never have to forget that. And 
and every single one that's made today, tomorrow, day after, they all go to that date automatically. It's not buy and sell from the date. If I put this one, uh, let's see, last when was the last one done? Here? It was this one? There you go. Uh, it's not even for sale yet. Silver. You see, you, how much was that again? Six. Six hundred seventy thousand dollars. It goes up a thousand. This goes up a dollar a day. This goes up twenty-four dollars a day. This goes up a thousand four forty a day, and this goes eighty-six thousand four hundred and four forty every. Eighty-six thousand four forty every single day, because there's eighty-six thousand four four hundred seconds or four forty. How many seconds in a day again? Eighty-six thousand four hundred seconds in a day. So. All the gold ones are going up 86,000. That's it. What is that? That's a million X. I don't know. But that's controversy. And that's a conversation piece. Whether you believe in this or not, it doesn't matter because there's three main things of this the war paint time from that date, and you know it already 02, 22, 2022. Take it or leave it. And I declare right now, at the end of this video, that this is a native art style. This is a native, the time price is, is, is shall be protected under my rights as a treaty status native in Canada, under the United Nations, under the art, under uh, indigenous uh, protected art. And I had my chief talk about the about it, saying that he'll back it up. That this is my thing, my art as a treaty status native, and nobody, no government, nobody in the world can touch my time pricing, and can't stop it because this is a treaty thing. You benefit from that. End of story. Ah. Uh, It's pretty simple, guys. Do you have a war paint yet? Do you have a yacht? Do you have one of my puppies? Do you have the timer? Uh, the ones, my favorite one is this uh, timer light. Because I, and this is a whole range of uh, painting that's on a white background uh, against my wall. That some of these are not even in that first one you saw. And these ones are kind of like if you want a little bit of light in your life uh, these these are the ones that go up forever and 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 theoretically you could buy like uh, say you buy five of these these ones right and how much do they go up again eleven thousand one hundred eighty one dollars as of today as of this minute this hour and you can sit on it if they're buying, bought and sold in the future here every in 10 years from now you can retire from what, what they are uh, and sell it 10 years from now whatever and so on and the amount of time it took me to paint my face and each one of these if they look good it took more time if they look bad it was less time uh, try painting in the squares in this uh, without smearing everything okay uh, cake this gold paint on your face and uh, which is super itchy and then play warp play video games all day in it and then just waiting for oh my god then I gotta make a painting with this I gotta play the video game then make the painting and then take pictures of my face oh my guys I I can never do it again literally but you look at some of this, it's my favorite. Uh, anything military, oh yeah. Uh, and I made these rare, by the way. You know how much this is, 40 million. So influencers, podcasters, people buy my stuff for the first time called first timers and anybody in my community my ecosystem my ecosystem is gonna be 
wealth, a lot of wealth that's going to be involved. Because I think anybody that spent years painting war paint on their face, playing video games, making paintings with that same war paint, and then putting them up as an NFT, I, how can it not? This one looks like I'm really, like I wasn't eating or something, but it's, you know, it's just the way it looks. It looks like I'm thin or something, but I'm not. And you can always trust a guy with the McDonald's guy. They were going to throw him in the garbage. I saved you. I, oh, Jack, I'm so happy. Yeah, I saved you, buddy. I saved you. They're going to throw him in the garbage. And I said, can I have him? They said, sure. Saves us from throwing him in the garbage. Because they'd have to crumple him up. Or I think they were going to shove him in the garbage. And I said, can I have him? And I took him home. Forget it. And podcasters, here, here's, your, here's your story. Here's your story. Oh. Here is your story. And that's a good story. It's a well deserved story. I think so. I deserve. I deserve. I think I do. I think I really deserve something out of this. I deserve. I deserve you guys talking about it. I really think. I deserve that. I deserve you guys talking about it. Should I beg next? No. Chuck Baller does not beg. He sells NFTs on the open water. I think. I think I gotta. Oh. Bunch of these are gonna be all down. To, uh, I'm waiting for these to run out, uh, and then I put them at a dollar, because I'm selling all the new ones at a dollar. But thank you so much for being here. Now it's all in your hands, Mr. Podcaster. I I comment on a lot of you guys, and I think uh, uh, some of you come in and you see the the song one there, and I think that's as far as you go. But maybe if I put podcaster podcasters influencers and open sea staff something like that and uh, keep this so you guys can see it and I hope you like the story I hope this is a good story I hope this is a good story for you to tell in your podcast because if anybody goes oh that guy is a scammer oh that guy's saw so that guy uh, They'll never sell anything. Well, you know the backstory. And if they watch this and they, they get directed to here, they know the backstory. And this one, I really like this one. How many backgrounds are in this one? Just three. And here's one that's. Beautiful. Beautiful. So, do I just, did I, uh, did I earn your, Mr. Podcaster? Did I, did I earn your attention? By the way, this is Cradle Commons, so you can share parts of this video. Uh, Project Zombie. Okay. And, uh, I am not stopping and after this video is done I am gonna go and put more of these up because if I show I do them every day and then people slowly come in maybe I'll earn my right for people to come and buy and buy out the project uh, the main collections are never gonna be for sale like for in bulk no and Thank you so much for watching. I'm not going to push this out any more longer than it can be. It's 39 minutes. We're going to stop it right at 100% right at 4, right at 40, 40 minutes. So thank you so much for being here.
Time is our friend. Time is our ally. All other NFTs are out of time. 